Have you ever wanted a keyboard which is cheap but durable? A keyboard which will be quiet and yet responsive and comfortable? Oh, yeah. Well, what we have here is something you're looking for. So, today we have a um, cheap keyboard from Modecom, if I remember well. Um, as someone who started YouTube, I need like a good keyboard which is comfortable for the editing for playing games, but at the same time doesn't make too much noises. Because if you have a bad mic, like I do, you will have to edit every click, you will have to cancel every click noise you will have in the recording. So, one day, I bought like a mouse, this one and no sound, no sound whatsoever when you click. And I was like, hey, I may need a keyboard like this, a keyboard which doesn't make noise. So after a bit of research on the internet, I found a um, keyboard from Razer, which you probably know too, because if you are a gamer and you're looking for keyboards, you have may stumbled across it, which was the Deathstalker. 2014, I suppose, yeah. So this keyboard is quiet because it has not a um, membrane keys but something like X scissors or something which is supposed to be like from the laptops, you know, the quiet laptop keyboard. And I was like, damn, that's pretty cool. It has also a backlit in green. I was thinking about buying it, but then I saw the price and I was like, damn, so now I'm not gonna give like 100 euros for a keyboard. So after a bit of research, I found this. This keyboard from the Modecom, something like that, from a um, Chinese probably mark. And we will see in a minute if it is worth its money. Come here, you little bit. It's a bit hard to do it because I have only one hand. And god damn it. God damn it. Alright, there we are. It's the package. The name says Volcano, although the name when you buy it would be something like this, MC800M. So we have this keyboard, it has this shiny little thingy, well that adds a bit of money to the price of the keyboard. So let's skip to the things, as you can see the shape of this keyboard is pretty much like the shape of the Razer Deathstalker. As I said, it's a cheaper version of the Deathstalker, it's about three times cheaper and we will see if it's actually worth the money. It appears that this keyboard has... focus a bit, goddammit. It has seven different backlight colors, blue, green, uh, darker blue, purple, white, yellow and red. So, let's see, let's see how it looks and let's see if it's actually that quiet as the producer says. Okay, okay, okay. And bam, there is the keyboard. So, Okay. The cable, you can see already, it's like a rubber thing, so it's not the best. Uh, the USB is not gold plated, so that's another. Well, it's not that bad of a thing, but it would be better if it was gold. And we have the keyboard right here. Oh, I like it. I don't know if you can see, but the keys are like rubbery too. They are not like plastic or anything, they are rubber like. Let's see. No sound. No sound whatsoever. Well, unless you go like. Then you will have any, any sound. So, I already see one thing that I may not like. You have these thing on the arrows, the letters, I don't know why, W-A-S-D, I don't know what are there for. Okay, maybe the space is a bit more, um, you know, gives a bit more of a sound, but no, I like this keyboard. The shape 
is practically identical to the Deathstalker. It doesn't only have the Razor uh, logo here. It has three buttons like the Razor here. Yeah, it's totally cool. I like it. So it's a bit like with this line things under the letters. I don't know what is that for and why it has only this part and this part doesn't have anything. But all right. We have also a functional key right here. I didn't uh, I didn't didn't realize that it had one. So when you need something just go functional key and all right. Let's see now how it will look with a backlit thing. It's a bit bright because it's morning where I live, so we're gonna have to improvise with this package, something like this. Alright, be right back. So, oh, there we go. I didn't even have a chance to say anything. Alright, that's cool. That's totally cool. Alright. This will be the red color. I don't know if we can. This thing will focus a bit. Come on. All right. So that's the red color. It's it's good because it's well made. Everything shines as it should. Every key is uh, really well illuminated. I have to say, and the space has this little like um, three LEDs. It's not, the whole thing is not illuminated, it has only three parts of it. So this would be the red, this would be the, ah, oh, majestic green. See, why buy a Rizal Death Stalker when you can have something three times cheaper and still have that goddamn green thing? Maybe the only one thing that I don't like are how the leathers are made, but come on. For its price, it, it, it shouldn't be that, it shouldn't bother that much. So darker blue, really cool. Uh, yellow. I don't like it, but alright. Oh, this is a pretty nice color. It's like uh, a really a mix of blue and green, I suppose. Alright. And uh, the purple. Cool. Also, the mode com logo will shine too. Cool and white all right that, that's good enough let's stop with the green because uh, uh because you know it needs to like match okay maybe that maybe it doesn't match that much but it's close close enough so the three buttons right here we have num lock caps lock and uh, where is the wind lock? No, that's not it. Uh, well, never mind. Anyway, so this is the Modcom MC800. I fucked up the name, goddammit. The MC800M, or as they like to call it, Volcano. So, it's really cheap. It's really cheap and I can tell you the keyboard is really cool, it doesn't make any sound, so that's a perfect thing for me. And I don't know, if it breaks anytime soon I will practically update it and I'll, may, I'll, I'll let you know if anything goes wrong with it. So that's it for now. I'll come back with some more gameplay soon I think because finally school is over and I have more time to do my stuff, my videos, and well, if anything, I'll let you know. So thanks for watching, and remember that soon there will be more.